preseason been going great. Um, guys are really trying to focus, you know, work hard. Uh, it's all about preparing, you know. I think everyone's excited to get outside. Uh, this first year we haven't really gotten outside before uh, Florida, so we're looking forward to getting there and getting out on the field and showing what we can do. So. I think we have an opportunity to have a very strong club again. Uh, the biggest thing, number one, right off the bat, is I'm impressed with our athleticism, which I think will be very strong on defense, and our pitching. I think our pitching depth can be as good as it's ever been. Uh, we have um, three excellent, established, returning pitchers. Eric Hungerford, who I believe is an All-American candidate, you know, was undefeated last year, led the nation in whip. Richie Power. Uh, had, a, had a great freshman year as one of our starters. Luke Lawrence, all-conference reliever. Uh, so, you know, those three guys is a good core to build around. And then we've got a, a bunch of other guys that have really come along that I think is going to give us good pitching depth and a good pitching staff. We graduated 13 guys. It's, you know, it was very tough, but I think we have a good um, core guys of pitchers that are back. You know, every team needs pitching and defense. So I think that's definitely our strength this year. As a team, you know, we're very well-rounded this year. Um, we can hit. Uh, we bring back a lot of pitching. Um, I think that's definitely going to be a strong suit. Um, and then defensively, we're, we're solid. You know, we don't make many mistakes. Um, but we've had a lot of guys who've kind of had to wait their turn. Uh, we had a big senior class last year. Um, so I think those guys are excited to, you know, finally get their time and, and prove what they can do. Um, so very well-rounded team. It's just a matter of going out there, performing, and uh, kind of hitting our stride at the right time. Uh, in the field, I've been impressed with our athleticism. Uh, we have a lot of holes to fill, obviously from last year's club, but I think we have you know, a lot of good guys that are fully capable of stepping up and doing that. But we have a good core of guys to build around, you know, with, and returning players, returning established players like Michael Boss in the outfield, uh, you know, Scotty Zangolini, all-conference shortstop, Corey Carajosi moving over to first base full time this year, uh, so it gives us a good core of guys to build around. But we've got a, you know, we've got a, I think a, a good group of uh, underclassmen that have kind of been waiting in the wings, uh, you know, to, to get their opportunity because uh, they were kind of you know stuck behind that group of guys we had last year, which was such an outstanding group of a bunch of three and four year starters. Uh, so I'm I'm excited about the possibilities. It's just a given every year that. Our number one team goal is obviously to win the conference. Um, last year we were the number one seed, but I think this year our first goal is just to get back into the playoffs and then, as we unfortunately learned last year, anything can happen once we're there that weekend, but we just need to make it to the playoffs and then try to string together a good weekend there at the end. Um, you know, myself and all the seniors are, you know, extremely grateful um, to be a part of this, you know, this team the last three years. Uh, we had, you know, great, great success and some of the best success in history of baseball here at Gaysburg. Um, you know, we feel blessed and honored and, uh, you know, we're, we're, luck we're lucky to be part of such great teams. Um, with that being said, you know, we can't, um, you know, bank on being as good every single year. You know, that's kind of our mentality and that's kind of the mentality Coach Campo said the last three years. You know, as that progressions continued, he kept saying, you know, last year doesn't matter, it's a new year. You know, I think that mentality has enabled us to be so, so successful. It's been exciting being on teams that have improved every year since I've been here. And obviously this is one of the best four-year periods of probably Gettysburg baseball history, and it's been exciting to be a part of that. And obviously we would love to continue that. We've set the records for wins the last two years, and I think it was 33 last year. That's a tough number to reach, but if we strive for that, then we should land right somewhere where we're happy with it at the end of the year. Really, we've come a long way. Um, I think that starts with, with coaching and attitude. Um, Really, our attitude's been, been great. You know, we come out every game, we're focused. Uh, we practice hard, we put in the time. Um, so as a program, it's great to see it grow. Um, but of course, you know, I'd like to leave the program with, with the championship. So hopefully we can do that this year. Uh, we've got a good group of guys, so I'm going to give it a shot, and uh, I, think, I think we can bring it home.